If you missed yesterday's video, make sure you go check it out. And thank you to Underdog Fantasy for sponsoring this video. But now it's that time to see where I'm going tomorrow. Let's roll the dice. All right. So technically I could land on the Rangers again if I rolled a two and then I'd just stay here. Or we got the Twins. We have the Diamondbacks, the Rockies, uh, the Marlins. <laughs> uh, let's see, we got the Nationals or the Brewers, Padres, and maybe the Astros. All right, let's see where I'm going. Ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Going to the Padres. All right, so it looks like the Padres do play tomorrow at home. So I'm going to San Diego. They're playing the Baltimore Orioles. And uh, they play at 640. So there is a flight out of Dallas at 11 a.m. And I'll land in San Diego at noon. So I'm going to go ahead and book this. It's through Frontier. It's 140 bucks. Let's go to San Diego. But first, I'm going to take a shower and go to bed. I'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning. It is uh, currently 8.15. I'm getting dressed, packing up. My flight is at 11 o'clock. So, um, let's get out of this hotel and get to the airport. I'm finally at the airport, and honestly, I am so tired. Yesterday I woke up at 4 a.m. Today I woke up at 7. Let's hope this flight to San Diego goes good. finally made it to the hotel. This place is awesome. It's like from 1915 or something crazy. Uh, it was the first skyscraper in San Diego. I had no idea I booked this place. Uh, like, it was just the cheapest place in downtown area. So I just took it. They also let me check in like an hour and a half early. So that was super clutch by them as well. It is currently three. The game doesn't go on until six, I think. Uh, it's a 20 minute walk, super chill. We have the number one team in baseball right now, which is the Orioles, and they are taking on the Padres. I'm excited to see the Padres. I have never seen them before, so excited to see Tatis play. Um, hopefully he has a good game. Hopefully I get to see some more home runs tonight. Last night at the Texas Rangers game, awesome the fireworks were crazy had no idea didn't expect that if you didn't see it make sure you go back and watch that video and do me a favor right now and hit that subscribe button and that thumbs up button it's a huge help this trip is costing me thousands of dollars to do so it's free just do it please before we go to the game let's go ahead and put our picks in on underdog sports do you want to make money on making picks on mlb games then you have to try underdog fantasy the easiest place to play fantasy sports. In Underdog's Pick'em games, you pick your favorite baseball player and try to predict if they'll go higher or lower on stats like hits, runs, strikeouts, and more. Pick between two and five players and get all your picks right, and you can win up to 20 times your money in a single night. Be sure to sign up with promo code SHOPBYHYPE and Underdog will double your first deposit up to $100. That way you have some extra bonus money to play with. Again, that's underdogfantasy.com or Underdog Fantasy in the App Store. Use my promo code SHOPBYHYPE and get your first deposit doubled up to $100. Now let's make those picks. 
for the Orioles, they have Adley Rutschman. We got 7.5 fantasy points, higher or lower. Let's hope Adley has a good game. I'm going to pick higher for that one. And then Fernando Tatis, same thing, but his is 8.5 fantasy points, higher or lower. I'm going to go higher with him and just hope both of these two guys have an elite game tonight. And with these two picks, I'll be able to triple up my money if I get them correctly. There we go. Easy as that. Now let's head to the game. made it to my seat. Um, this seat's definitely better than yesterday's seat. I mean, what a view. Uh, first impressions of this stadium, obviously it's beautiful, but getting around, there's like so many dead ends here and it's like hard to get around and a lot of entry points. Um, but other than that, man, this place is beautiful. I walked here, it took like 10 minutes. The downtown here in San Diego is awesome. This is my second time here, but uh, first time here to Petco Park. Super excited to get some food and see some good baseball. Iberia Taco. This is, looks fresh. They made it right in front of me. It was $9.25 for this one taco. But I have a feeling it's going to be worth it. Fresh, flavorful, good ingredients. Man, 100% worth it. All right, let's give this hot dog a try. Hot dog was 24 cents cheaper than yesterday's hot dog and it's bigger and the bun feels soft. Already a win in my book. Yeah, that's a 10 out of 10. That's a perfect hot dog. Let's get back in this taco. Food here, 10 out of 10. I can't complain. All this right here was, I think, 20 bucks. Really not that bad. I'll probably get some more. Very excited about this. And honestly, this view adds to it too. Doesn't get better than this. To add to the great park, it has like this grass area that you can just come out and chill at. This might be my number one favorite park after tonight, which is kind of a coincidence because the Orioles is my favorite park. And uh, that's who we're playing tonight. This is honestly what I'm looking for in a park. Rushman leading it off here for the O's. High drive to right field. Gamble will have room as he gets back shy of the track and makes the catch. But a 1.91 ERA. And sharply hit by the dive. And Urias at third base down to the left field corner. Kim is headed for two. It rattles around down there. He will round second base but hold on with a leadoff double. 
to start the bottom of the first inning. Brad Gary Sanchez. Golden opportunity for the Padres to get some runs here in the first. And a fly ball right field. Back goes Santander at the wall. It's gone! The first grand slam of the season for the Padres. It's Slam Diego. Belongs to Gary Sanchez. And the Padres take a 5 Tatis Jr. That's a fair ball. Down the left field line. It kicks to Hayes. His throw to second base will be late, and it's a double for Fernando. Right down the line, and the third base umpire, Eric Marcus, all over it down there. All right, at the top of the sixth, Padres are up by 10. It's crazy how every game I go to, it's a blowout. Tatis has done his job. I've got 11 fantasy points with him, so I've already won that. But Adley has done nothing but strike out, so it's not looking good. I think he'll get one more at bat, but I need him to hit like a home run or a triple, and a triple probably isn't going to happen. I'm back at the hotel. I had to leave the game a little bit early because I know since I'm on the West Coast, whatever game I go to tomorrow is gonna be on the East Coast, which means I'm probably gonna have to go to sleep really early and get up really early. So, came back to the hotel room. Right now, it's the seventh inning. Baltimore scored one, it's 10-1. Still, Adley did nothing for me. He might have another at bat. I'll update y'all later if he does. But for now, I lost. You win some, you lose some. As far as the park goes, man, honestly, Petco Park is ranked number one on my list of parks. Like, it was just the perfect park. It's so big, like the compound around it, like you got the grass area, you had so many food places. All the food was so good too, it was all fresh. It was 71 degrees with a breeze. It was just perfect. Man, like if you ever get a chance to go to Petco Park to watch Padres do it but now I have to see where I'm going tomorrow so let's set up the board I was on the Padres all right so I can go to the Astros the Mets free parking which would be nice the Cardinals the Dodgers the Pirates the Giants the Phillies the Cubs and maybe the Braves mm -hmm. 